Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new video and welcome back to Championship Prediction. A few of the results over the previous weekend didn't exactly go to plan for some clubs. Some games, you know, didn't go to plan for some clubs and the opposition had a field day. Um, but anyway, guys, you know what I do. So guys, you know what to do. Subscribe for more. Thanks for watching and let's go. So the first game I'm going to talk about is Middlesbrough versus Stoke City. Middlesbrough losing 3-1 home, away from home sorry, to Swansea. Stoke 0-0 at home to Reading. Um, I don't think Stoke had a bad game drawing to Reading. Um, middle spot, you know, slightly just outside the playoffs by three points. Um, and the closest team to them is Stoke. Um, so this game's going to be interesting. I mean, if Luton Town slip up this weekend and Stoke win, Stoke will be out of the relegation zone for the first time this season. I don't think they started down there due to the alphabetical order, but I'm saying since they got in there. Um, but this game is going to be a bit of an interesting one. Um, I know Stoke, uh, not Stoke, sorry, Middlesbrough, you know, have started to get your win under uh, Jonathan Woodgate and obviously buying him time. Um, but as far as this one goes, I'll go for a one all scoreline for that one. My next one is Cardiff versus Preston. Um, Cardiff 3-3 free free against Leeds away from home. Preston beating Luton Town 2-1 at home. That Leeds game, watching the scores at home like I do sometimes, um, and Leeds went 3-0 up and completely slipped up. Um, great comeback by Cardiff. Very much unexpected. I wasn't expecting it on the day, I could tell you that. Um, but I think that sort of result... Um, not just for Cardiff, for any team in any league. If you find yourself three goals down, don't give up. Anything can happen in this game, um, as we all should know, really. But um, Cardiff currently sitting in 12th, and that's put them 32 points. Um, you know, going up against a very OK Preston North End team, um, you know, 37 points in third position and 10 points behind leagues. I think that um, win for Preston, not the Luton Town win, but the one previous, I think that's done in a world of good. Um, but as far as this result goes, I'll go for a one all scoreline for that one as well. My next one is Fulham versus Leagues. Just that you mentioned the Leagues result, um, Leagues losing, uh, not losing, sorry, 3-3 free free at home. To Cardiff, very much got to feel like a defeat for Leagues. Um, Fulham losing 1 0 away to Brentford. Fulham, um, you know, just sitting in the playoff places by the skin of their teeth. Um, there are still games in hand, not so I've got a game in hand over Fulham. Um, so, you know, Fulham can easily find themselves at the playoff places once. And um, not for us to play that game. Um, leagues are gonna want to win this, claim top spot back. Um, disappointing day by leagues. Um, but as far as this one goes, I'll go for a 2 1 Fulham win. My next one is Huddersfield versus Nottingham Forest. Um, Nottingham Forest loses 4 0 at home. To Sheffield Wednesday. Um, Huddersfield 1-1 um, one, one away from home against Wigan. Disappointing day for Huddersfield. Um, you know, under their new management, started to find their feet. And, you know, not a great result. But I'm going to talk about Notch Forest's result. Um, Notch Forest losing 4 Nil at home. Um, now we are not for his team that, yeah, again sitting off 
the player placed by a point. Um, and as I said, got that game in hand as well. But losing 4 0 at home to her, Sheffield Wednesday, sorry for us fans, I just can't get my head around it. Um, you know, very disappointing day for Nottingham Forest. I think this is the second game they lost on the bounce, which I'm going to go for a 2 1 Huddersfield win. My next one is Hull City versus Birmingham City. Um, Hull 2 2 away to Cheltenham. Cheltenham. Um, Birmingham loses 3 2 at home to um, West Brom Jalbion. Um, that Birmingham result, I think it's about out of order on Birmingham. If I remember rightly, that game was on a Friday night. Um, I watched that game and I was thinking about, you know, Birmingham to serve a point out of that. Um, I was very unlucky not to. But it's the same sort of thing with the Leagues game. Um, you know, Leagues for 3 no up and, you know, probably deserve all three points but didn't. Um, but this game's going to be slightly interesting, how full team. Um, Birmingham in 15th, so get a, cha a table change again. This could be which one go go for a one nil whole win. My next one is Luton Town versus Swansea City. Swansea City beat in Middlesbrough 3 1 at home. Hull, uh, sorry, Luton losing 2 1 at, away from home to Preston. That whole. That, sorry, why do I keep mentioning Hull? got a hole stuck in my head. Um, that Swansea City game. Great three points for Swansea. Disappointing day for Luton. Um, but I'm going to go for a 2 now Swansea City win. My next one is. Millwall versus Barnsley. Um, Barnsley beating QPR 5 3 at home. Uh, you know, great three points for Barnsley. Um, Derby count, uh, sorry, Millwall losing one, uh, beating, um, Mill, uh, beating Derby County 1 0 away from home. Um, great three points going in for both of these clubs. Big three points for um, Preston possibly coming up. Um, but I'm going to go for a 2 1 Millwall win. Um, my next one is Queen's Park Rangers versus Charlton Athletic. Charlton Athletic 2 2 at home to Hull. Queen's Park Rangers lose the 5 3 away from home to Barnsley. Um, this game, a bit of a London derby, um, you know, with the likes of QPR been in the championship for quite a while now. Chelton still newly promoted to the championship. But I'm going to go for a 2-2 scoreline for this one. My next one is Reading versus Derby County. Um, Derby lose, uh, losing 1-0 at home to Millwall. Reading losing 1-0. Uh, sorry, drawing 0-0 away to Stoke. Um, I'm going to go for a 1 now Reading win. My next one is West Bromwich Albion versus Brentford. Um, Brentford beating Fulham 1 0 at home. West Bromwich Albion beating Birmingham City 3 0 away from home. Um, where are Brentford? Fourth. So, you know, this, this could be a really good game. Um, you know, to even try and put pressure on leagues. Um, 
But then West Brom got to do the same to um, keep the pressure on Leeds as well. But I'm going to go for another 1 1 scoreline for that one. Expected a lot of 1 1s, but you know what's happened in this league already. Um, my next one is Sheffield Wednesday versus Bristol City. Um, Sheffield Wednesday, 4 um, 0 away from home against Nottingham Forest. Great three points for Sheffield Wednesday. Great day out for the Sheffield Wednesday fans. Bristol City losing 2-0 at home to Blackburn. I know that result, I know I got that correct because one of you guys updated me on it and, uh, you know, I won't say what you said, but um, I actually get one dead on, I was actually quite surprised myself. Um, <coughs> sorry. Um, but Sheffield Wednesday company sitting in 5th. Bristol City sitting in seventh, and um, yet again they're gonna need these to a draw for them to step up or a win and for them to draw over back of the places. But I'm gonna go for a two one Bristol City win. My last one for this weekend is Blackburn Rovers versus Wigan Athletic. Wigan Athletic 1-1 one, one at home against Huddersfield. Um, Blackburn Rovers, just as you mentioned it, beating Bristol City 2-0 away from home. Great three points for Blackburn. Um, if you watch that prediction, you will have heard what I said about Bristol City and why I gave that result. There is always a reason why I give my results the way I do. Um, but, you know, as I said, all the talk to your own opinions and do feel free to put your comments and everything down below and, you know, have a conversation with me if you'd like to. Um, we're going to miss another big game for them to try and get out of the bottom three. Um, going up against an OK Blackburn Rovers side. I mean, Blackburn Rovers sit on 35, 34 points and literally yet another team just outside the playoffs. Um, you know, with a point. Sorry, uh, that I just that Bristol City are only out on the playoff places on goal difference. Um, but yeah, it still sort of need the same thing to happen to obviously get in there. Um, this I'm gonna go for a three nil Blackburn win. But anyway, guys, you know what to do. Give us a big fat thumbs if you enjoy it. Subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. Ciao for now.